right, welcome back everyone. So we're keeping on going and going and going. Look, Titanfall multiplayer trailer was the first glimpse of Titanfall 2. Well, Titanfall 2, sorry. Was the first glimpse of the game that we saw. Obviously, Respawn is trying to re-energize. They, they're releasing the game on all platforms now and um, they really believe in the game, right? Because some studios, what they do sometimes is uh, if they don't believe in the project, if they don't think they did well enough the first time around, then they'll just scrap it and work on a new IP. But they really believe in the project. Apparently Titanfall sold just enough for EA to be like, okay, you know what, we're going to give you another shot. And also they're working on a Star Wars game, which is nuts. So um, Titanfall 2, the multiplayer stuff, obviously they did a live reaction for it. So let's go ahead and take a look. Thank you, Titanfall Andrew. 2, starting off the Both show one. It's great to be strong. back uh, near Smart. E3. Um, so, Titanfall introduced millions of players around the world to the fast, fluid, pilot and Titan gameplay that is at the heart of Titanfall. And with the release of Titanfall 2, we're excited to welcome PS4 players to the franchise for the first time. Yeah. Okay. Multi-platform is always the way to go. Exclusives are uh, dumb. We'll start off with a look at what players can expect out of uh, Titanfall multiplayer. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. That movement. It looks good, man. Wow. Okay. Wow, looks awesome, looks like a lot of fun. You know, I always love Got movement. It. Movement around the map is so, essential for a first person shooter multiplayer Titanfall game like that. Titanfall 2 builds on the signature pilot and Titan gameplay to deliver a more robust experience. All right, look, like I keep on saying all the time, when it comes to multiplayer, I, all I want is just chaos. I want more things to think about. I want to be attentive. I want to be just on alert every single second while I'm playing in a match because matches tend to be short sometimes. So if you have crazy five minute bursts of just chaos, then that's obviously positive. Now, one of the things that Titanfall got really, really right the first game was movement. Uh, that's what they're known for. They have Call of Duty guys. The gunplay feels great because the Call of Duty guys are working on it. Um, and maybe obviously help from others as well, but the gunplay was on point. The movement was great. The, the game just, Something about it, and I think it's because it was one of the first current-gen games that was really lacking content and just came out multiplayer, and I think people just weren't okay with that from the very beginning, and they decided with Titanfall, so so once the multiplayer servers got up and once the game was released and everything was going smoothly, at least for a week or two, and then people started to dive down, and then a month or two months or three months later, 90% of you know the people playing the game were not playing it anymore. Um, so that's kind of the situation with Titanfall. With Titanfall 2, the multiplayer specifically, I'll speak on the single player in another video. In another video. But the multiplayer, they have a grappling hook. You're, you're interacting with, you know, you're interacting with the, the mechs in a different way. Um, it's just, you see missiles flying through the sky and that's a lot like Titanfall was, but it seems to be, you know, current gen now. And, uh, it seems to have this more cinematic flair and there's like missiles going everywhere and it just, it, it creates that battlefield one type of mentality where there's just so much shit going on that you just, you just have to stand there in awe. And, uh, you know, Titanfall 2 has that kind of charm to it. So, um, as far as multiplayer experiences go, I'm definitely looking forward to this one. 
This one looks great. Uh, I, 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 for some reason, I really trust that Respawn team. Uh, when they got announced for Star Wars, I was just like, that's that's awesome. That sounds cool. Third-person action and adventure. Uh, they're not even working. I mean, Titanfall 2 is basically a, a first-person shooter. Um, and I just want to see how the level design changes, or, the, you know, in, in particular, certain maps, right? Uh, I want to see how they get creative with the movement, with the grappling hook, with, you know going up against the wall and, and shooting guys down below you and above you. And that's what it's all about. It's about verticality, movement, chaos, mechs, fighting each other with swords. It's, it's really great. It's really fun. And it's just absolutely uh, insane gameplay. So that multiplayer showcased really, really well. I really liked it. And hopefully you guys did as well. But let me know in the comments what you guys thought. Of course, if you hate me, you know what to do. If you like me, you know what to do. And I'll see you guys all on the next one.